Hey lovely, welcome back to my channel. It's me, your sharer. In today's video, I want to share with you my pamper morning skincare routine here in Dubai. Self disclaimer, I don't do this complete set of routine on a daily basis, but more of a twice a week basis because I have a relatively sensitive skin. On most days, I do a very simple and quick skincare routine. But today, I want to share with you my complete skincare routine that I like to do on days where I need a little bit more pamper so you get the whole idea of how my morning skincare routine go. Before we move on, if you could like and subscribe, it would really help me out and let me know if it was helpful to you in the comments below and I'll link down everything I use in the description box below. First thing first, I have to share with you this amazing silky pillowcase and the satin eye mask from Coco and Eve. This beauty bundle set is kindly gifted by Coco and Eve and it comes with two different colors which are pink and green. And look at how pretty is their packaging. It feels so soft and luxe and it makes my entire beauty sleep so relaxed and comfortable. This Yuki pillowcase helps to keep my hair much less frizzy when I wake up and it's so comfortable when I'm laying on it. So if you're considering to get the beauty bundle set, I have a discount code ROSHA that you can use to get a 10% discount. I normally wake up at 7 a.m. and straight going to the bathroom to cleanse my face. I like it with cold water because it always wake me up from the sleepy mood. That's love. I have been using the Cetaphil Facial Daily Cleanser for months because it's very gentle for my sensitive skin and able to leave my skin feeling refreshed and healthy. And because of that gentle formula, it will never leave my skin feeling dry or tight. It is clinically tested hypoallergenic and non-comedogenic, so it's good for sensitive skin. I think most of us know about this facial cleanser, it's quite a hype on TikTok. Pat my face dry with my towel and apply my holy grey lip balm for Burps B. If you have read my interview with Bubit, you know how much I love this lip balm. It literally saves my life. If you haven't, I'll link my interview article with Bubit in the description below. Today is the day when I like to do an extra step for my morning skincare routine. So I'm using this Emu Apple Super Bounce Mask from Sense and Sky. I love a good hydrating and brightening mask. So when Sense and Sky gifted this to me, I was so excited to try it out and I've been using it for over a month. It is cruelty free and packed with super potent antioxidants like glow berries. It has kakadu plum, hyaluronic acid, and jojoba oil in its ingredients. I do this mask twice a week and I like to spread a thick layer on the clean skin and let it rest for 8 to 10 minutes and rinse it off with water. While waiting for the face mask to sink in, I normally just go to my bed and do some stuff with my computer. Time to rinse off my mask. I like to give some facial massage with my fingers while I'm cleaning to ensure everything is clean. Of course, always give a few spray of spring turmeric water from Avon to calm my skin. I personally do not have any favorite toner, still testing and trying out different ones to find a one that I really like. Currently, I'm using this Watermelon Glow Pore Titer Toner from Glow Recipe. It's been doing a pretty good job to my skin, so I think I'm gonna get a bigger one for myself. This toner is inspired by the Korean Aqua Pew Facial, which focuses on the duality of exfoliating and hydrating. It is so important to always have toner to help prep your skin to readily absorb the rest of my routine. Next up is my Hydration Boost Cream from Sense and Sky. I love it. It's so lightweight and hydrating to my skin and it always adds a natural glow to my skin yet it does not feel heavy and oily at all. I use this every morning and night. In its formula, it has hyaluronic acid 
that locks in the moisture fermented sea kelp that smooths my skin and red seaweed extracts form to prevent dehydration and it is what i needed for my sensitive skin and it does its job really well i truly enjoyed this product myself so i definitely recommend you guys to get it and try it out yourself if you're getting it i have a discount code rosha for you to enjoy 10 percent discount for all sense and sky products and i'll also link down the products in the below description box next up it's also my current obsession fortuna skin is a clean beauty brand made from italy it uses olive oil and water infused with leaves from the olive trees for most of its beauty products they are so kind enough to give me their famous replenishing balm that is made with a natural blend of medicinal botanicals that rejuvenate stress skins while restoring luminosity i use this as the last step of my skincare routine to lock in all the hydration and moisture because it is a balm instead of a cream which is made with oil so i I only use a tiny dot of the balm and apply it on sensitive areas where it usually gets acne and i see the improvement on my skin because ever since i started using this product it has helped me so much with healing my acne and the frequency of getting acne has reduced so much also this balm literally smells like i'm in a spa <laughs> it feels so luxurious unfortunately i do not have a discount code for you but if you love that i could try my best to get one for you let me know in the comment down below after all the skincare prep my one last final step to complete my morning skincare routine is of course the spf sunscreen i I cannot emphasize more enough how important it is to always put on sunscreen no matter what even if you're staying indoor for that i use super goop glow sunscreen for my face it is lightweight and adds a natural glow to the skin it doesn't leave a white cast and most importantly it does not contain harmful ingredients it glides and blends so beautifully on the skin sometimes i use this as a primer before my makeup to just add a boost of glow with my foundation but if you have an oily skin i would not recommend because it might be too oily for your skin type as for the body i am using this body polish with uv protections from this company called do it it is supper olive oil combined with sunflower oil and argan oil top with vitamin b and vitamin e for a full antioxidant glow it is actually my first time trying this product as you can see the roller doesn't really work for me because it can't really spread the product evenly on my body so i actually prefer to use it with my hands which i personally think that is actually faster and better it does what it says adding some glow to my body but if you ask me for my personal preference i would go for a body sunscreen which has both um good spf and adding natural glow at the same time and ever since i moved to dubai i spent a lot of my time in my room because it has an amazing view and vibe so i like to do a lot of my stuff in my room so after everything is done i like to go to my bedside fill up a glass of water to keep myself hydrated and read a book the recent book i've been reading is called the great secret it is a gift from my best friend so i've been trying to read every single day in the morning to keep up a good morning routine unless i got something caught up so yeah that's all for today's video i hope you guys enjoy it and find it helpful to make some choices for your skincare routine make sure to subscribe to my channel smash the like button and click the bell notifications for more videos like this in the future i will see you all in my next video bye